a couple months ago, I, uh, I left my consulting gig for San Diego Gas and Electric, and I started with a company called Ryotech Scientific. And uh, I'll be happy to uh, send that uh, link along or uh, just so you can post it up. But we do precision optics uh, for a number of different industries. Uh, we're doing things that uh, actually we're building a, a new uh, dome uh, for a submarine. Uh, I think it's, uh, I, I want to call them a Croton Company or something like that. Then the name escapes me right now. But we're building a brand new dome uh, for a submarine that's going to go down to the bottom of the Mariana Trench. And, and in addition to that, on the opposite end of the spectrum, we're doing a number of precision optics for multiple space programs. In fact, we are the sole source for NASA for the Orion crew modules, um, for the new Artemis project, which is uh, basically a, a commercial space project, and also the Axiom space station, which is also uh, commercial, and that's being put together from uh, uh, companies mm -hmm. that are working with the European Space Agency, specifically Dallas Athenia Space. And uh, we are looking for a new QM manager, somebody that would need to be uh, able to work with the AS9100D cert, as well as ISO 9001. Uh, we have our AS9100. We just went through a research due to a facility move, so we had to go through the whole process. But we, in fact, had all the certifying agencies at our facility within the last month. And uh, we recertified and repassed our, our AS9100. But we're building multiple panes for Lockheed Martin. Uh, we're doing it for Boeing for the Starliner program that they have going. Uh, Thales has uh, came to us basically based on the uh, strength of our relationship we built with NASA. And I have learned more about high pressure fused silica glass, um, various cast acrylic, stretched acrylic, and polycarbonate materials because uh, panes, for example, that we're doing for, for Thales uh, for, for their program, these are, these are multiple panes. So you have the fused silica, which is the outer debris pane, and then your inner debris pane, which is redundancy, is, is typically going to be an acrylic material. And then you have yet another pressure pane inside of that. And then a fourth pane, which is made out of polycarbonate, which is called the scratch pane. And that is the, the pane that the, the astronauts would be in contact with inside of the actual uh, cabin um, in the module. So we, we build these things and take this stuff to a level of clarity and, and polishing that has to be built and strengthening that has to be built. And uh, we're looking for a new QA manager. The, 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 the previous QA manager for Ryotech uh, was a uh, retired Navy Master Chief gunner's mate, but he's going back to the shipbuilding world and he was specifically recruited. So now we have a need for a new QM manager. And um, you know, I thought I would put that out to folks on the team, if anybody wants to come and work for a small company, uh, we are a small company, but I think we have a very bright future based upon the uniqueness of what we build and uh, the, the number of relationships we've built and uh, hoping that uh, if not anybody, if anybody's interested directly, or if you have people within your network, uh, we would love to, to hear from you. So uh, that's that's kind of the news of what we're doing with Ryotech Scientific, which it's a pretty neat company. We're only about 25 people strong, but we do some really, really stuff, interesting stuff. And we've been in business since the early 90s. So it's we're not going anywhere soon, but uh, love to get some quality people to come on board if interested. And that is incredible. I, I am not a QA professional, but I would like to know where I shine up. <laughs> it sounds like it's such a cool mission. I mean, uh, well, just a general uh, engineer. We're looking for another engineer to work for our aerospace department, too. And, okay. and what we're doing with Dallas is uh, these these things are going to be going on for years. I mean, the, the, the yeah. uh, different missions that they have. So, and then additionally, uh, we were part of a very select team that we're going to be part of the NASA Da Vinci program. And we're going to be building uh, the panes for the probes that they're sending to Venus. <laughs> 